Once upon a time in a small village, there lived a kind-hearted girl named Cinderella. She was known for her beauty and gentle nature, but her life was far from perfect. After her beloved mother passed away, her father married a woman named Lady Tremaine, who had two daughters of her own, Anastasia and Drizella. Unfortunately, Lady Tremaine was a wicked and selfish woman. Cinderella's life took a drastic turn after her father passed away unexpectedly, leaving her at the mercy of her stepmother and stepsisters. Lady Tremaine made Cinderella work as a servant in her own home, cleaning, cooking, and tending to every need of her stepsisters. Despite the hardships, Cinderella never lost her kindness and optimism. One day, an invitation to the royal ball arrived at the Tremaine household. The entire kingdom was invited, and Cinderella's stepsisters were overjoyed. They immediately began preparing for the grand event, leaving Cinderella to help them with their dresses and hairstyles. Her heart ached as she watched them get ready, knowing she wouldn't be allowed to attend. As the evening of the ball approached, Cinderella found herself alone in the kitchen, tears welling up in her eyes. She wished she could go to the ball and escape her miserable life if only for a few hours. Suddenly, a soft, melodic voice echoed through the kitchen. Have courage and be kind. Dear Cinderella, a gentle voice whispered, and Cinderella looked around in surprise, but there was no one there. To her astonishment, Cinderella saw a flurry of sparkling light surrounding her. In an instant, her ragged dress transformed into a magnificent gown. Her hair was adorned with a delicate tiara, and her feet were covered in glass slippers. The voice had granted her a beautiful transformation. Cinderella couldn't believe her eyes. With newfound confidence and excitement, she made her way to the royal ball, where she was greeted by gasps of admiration from all who saw her. Even her stepsisters didn't recognize her. Cinderella danced gracefully with the prince, feeling as if she were floating on air. However, the magical night couldn't last forever. As the clock struck midnight, Cinderella remembered the warning she had received. She fled from the ball, leaving behind a single glass slipper. The prince desperately searched for her but all he found was the delicate slipper. Cinderella returned to her life as a servant, cherishing the memories of the enchanting knight. The prince, determined to find the mysterious beauty who had captured his heart, traveled throughout the kingdom with the glass slipper, searching for its owner. Finally, the slipper came to Cinderella's household, and her stepsisters tried to force their feet into it, but it was too small for them. Just as they were about to give up, Cinderella revealed herself and asked to try on the slipper. It fit her perfectly. Recognizing her as the enchanting woman from the ball, the prince declared Cinderella as his one true love. They were married in a grand ceremony and Cinderella forgave her stepsisters, showing them kindness and grace. Cinderella's story became a legend in the kingdom, a testament to the power of kindness and the belief that dreams can come true. She and the prince lived happily ever after, ruling their kingdom with love and compassion, and Cinderella's tale continued to inspire generations to come.